Mrs. Campbell's Sweet Chow Chow. Homestyle Sweet Southern Relish. And I've got my pinto beans here. I'm going to take them. And put them in. And I use um, cornbread in mine. So that's how they're eaten usually. They really add a a great taste to the beans, especially when you eat the beans without uh, salt. I'm used to eating salt and everything, but living without salt, learning to live without salt, it's a great uh, addition to your beans or anything else. You can use them for hamburgers, hot dogs, sandwiches. Anything at 16 ounces available at Walmart or any other. It's not any kind of an Amish thing or anything, but it's very sweet. And it's a very sweet taste, like sweet relish, pickle relish, but, you know, this stuff has extra ingredients. This is not just in, uh, relish from Walmart. This is not just relish. I mean, this is homestyle southern relish. A homestyle southern relish. And again, it's healthy for you. Only 20 calories. You can't read this because it won't fill It has cabbage, vinegar, salt, sugar, red bell peppers, dried onions. You see, it has those ingredients in it. It doesn't have a lot of citric acid and stuff in it, so. It doesn't have any saturated fat, so this stuff is really good. And it has... Uh, the peppers and onions in it so it has the peppers and onions in it so that's what makes it good is the peppers and onions and I would say it's as good as anything else cabbage yeah it has cabbage it's not pickle relish I imagine it has cabbage vinegar water sugar red and red bell peppers and dried onions so I guess in, instead of using um, pickles, you know, it's not pickled relish. Usually relish is made of pickles. I think it is pickles. Hmm. I don't think so. It didn't say it has any pickles in it. Pickled cabbage, I imagine. Pickled cabbage with vinegar in You know, in vinegar, it was pickled cabbage. So, it's different, you know, than regular pickle relish. It's different than regular pickle relish. It's your homestyle southern relish. It doesn't have um, their regular ingredients in it. Red bell peppers. It's different. It really is. It has sugar in it. Real sugar. So if you like all the natural ingredients. Red peppers and dried onions. Cabbage vinegar. And it's good stuff. If you like it, and you like soup beans especially, it's more of a southern thing. And if you like uh, your soup beans like I do, then I made a pot of soup beans last night in the crock pot. They're done today. You know, thanks to my mom, she ate two and a half bowls of them, of the beans. So there's not too many beans left. So I'll catch you on the flip side. Like, share, subscribe, join the revolution, and I'm going to catch you with the Zendel.